I'm here to show off the grandfather clock that I built. And this is the long distance shot, and then I'm going to get up closer here in a moment. Uh, it is approximately six feet high, and I found some uh, details on how to build this in a woodworking magazine. So I thought I'd give this a go. So we'll start at the top and kind of work our way down. So as you can see, we got a nice face there and I bought the, the paper that actually goes to this clock. You can use different options and then you have the different the pointers and I installed those and then we have the the kind of the decorative part that kind of goes around it. What's kind of cool is I've got this little little door hinge thing here and the this is actually glass that I had cut specifically uh, for for this project so I can just kind of open and close it as I need and we're good to go so from there this is something that my uncle Bob showed me to do he showed me how to do some routing and so I had to do some corner cuts and do some routing and so that is at the top and the bottom so I used MDF wood uh, for this project and then I stained it uh, varying varying shades of the kind of the darker brown and then the there's a second kind of part to it where I bought a pendulum a pendulum for it as well and what's kind of cool there's a kind of a oh guess what it's 11 o'clock let's look around to the back I hadn't put the back cover on yet but here we are we've got our little uh, uh, chimes going and so that goes off every hour and then one per uh, half hour and so there's the part for the pendulum that swings back and forth and that has a battery pack and then there's a battery pack for the uh, timing timer as well and it takes it does perfect times pretty amazing so but I had a uh, put that all together and put it on a back and kind of make sure that all those details worked with that. So that ended up turning out really, really well. And so the, the other part I wanted to show you about the pendulum is, is that the door swings open here as well. So there's a, some door pieces and then that just kind of goes right in there. And then we've got our little pendulum there. So that's, and then we've got a, a base that, that I've, uh, built again we've got the uh, some of the routing work done there as well and so the the piece just turned out beautiful very pleased with it so I'll close this part up and put it all together uh, it took quite some time to uh, put this all together but it it was well worth it and it's a nice addition to uh, some of our furniture at our house